Dr. Kevin Logan here in Brown County, Indiana. Just wanted to give you an update on my bees. I installed two colonies this year. I'm super excited to have bees again. They're so fun to observe over time, watch their behavior and learn from them. And the thing I really most enjoy about beekeeping is the fact that they live in community. In the summertime, the bees make honey, so they have energy to make it through the winter. And in the winter time, they use that honey to basically keep the internal temperature of the hive to approximately 97 degrees. They do that by just flapping their wings, keeping the queen warm so that she can survive the winter along with the other workers. One thing I find fascinating about bees is they're a perfect example of epigenetics. Basically, the DNA of the larva of a bee can become either a worker, a drone, or a queen. And what determines the transformation of that DNA into the protein structures that develop that particular larva into those types of bees is what they feed them. For example, when the colony recognizes that the queen is getting old, she's not laying as many eggs and they need a new queen, then what they do is they feed this larva the royal jelly, which has a lot of amino acids, B12, folate, all kinds of rich minerals. They feed that to this larva and that larva then becomes a new queen. In a colony of bees, you can only have one queen. When the colony determines that they need a new queen, they will start feeding the larva that nutritious food in order to make a new queen. And then those two queens duke it out until one of the queens survives, which is usually a younger queen, and then she continues the colony. I love this. Bees work in community and I just think that's amazing to watch. So I love observing bees.